Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice algebra equation from here? We have 2 times a square minus 2 times b square equals to 98. We want to find the value of a and b such that a and b are remainder of natural number. From here, we have 2 a square minus 2 b square equals to 98. On this side, we can factor 2 out and we have 2 into bracket a square minus b square which is equal to 98 and uh, we can divide both sides by 2 These 2 we cancel out Then on this side, we are left with a square minus b square which is equal to here, we will mean 49 Then from here we apply the difference of two squares and this will be a plus b multiplied by a minus b equals to 49 and uh, when we separate 49 the possible way of writing 49 are you can say this is minus 1 times minus 49 or we can write it as 1 times 49 or we can write it as 7 times 7 or we can also write it as minus 7 times minus 7 then when we look at this we said a and b should be a member of natural number from here a plus b is greater than or equals to a minus b then when we look at the first, you know, case, here is negative and here is negative, so it's not, you know, a member of natural number. Natural number are positive number from one, two, and so on. So here we give us negative. We are going to have negative results. So here will not be in consideration. So we have positive one, positive forty-nine. So here we consider that and also 7 and 7 also will be part of you know natural number then from here minus 7 minus 7 also this will not be considered then we can then equate a plus b for the first case 1 and 49 from here a plus b will be 49 because it's greater than equal to a minus b. So a minus b for that case is equal to 1. Then for the other side, we also equate that to the first to 7 and the second to 7. So we have a plus b to be equal to 7 and uh, a minus b from here to be equal to 7 as well. Then for this side, let's solve by adding this equation and eliminate b. We have a plus a, that's 2a, equals to 49 plus 150. Divide both sides by 2 from here. We have a left here, which is equals to 25. Then we solve for b from the first equation here. We have a plus b equals to 49. a then is 25 plus b now, which is 49. So we take 25 to that side, we have b equals to 49 minus 25. So b here will give us 24. Then from here we can say that the solution a comma b will be equals to a 25 then b 24. So we have the first set of solution from here. Then on this side as well. We solve here by adding these two equations, then we have 2a equals to 14 from here. Divide both sides by 2. 2 cancel out here. We have a equals to 7. Then solve for b from the first equation. We have a plus b equals to 7. Here a is 7. That's 7 plus b equals to 7. We have b now equals to 7 minus 7. So b equals to 0. Then the second set of solution from here, that is a comma b, we then give us a which is 7, 
mb comma zero so we have this also as a you know value of a and b then we can check from here to see if this set of solutions satisfy the given problem the first one we have 25 and 24 so a is 25 then b is 24 now let's continue from here to check from this line we have a square minus b square equals to 49 so for the first solution we have 25 square that's a minus b that's 24 square if this equals to 49 from here then when we check 25 square give us 625 then minus 24 square 576 is this giving us 49 from here then when we subtract on this side of course this will be 49 which is equal to 49 on this side we have left hand side equals to right hand side then from here we say that 25 comma 24 satisfy the given problem then also we test for a equals to 7 b equals to 0 very quickly from here when we put a equals to 7 and uh, b equals to 0 from here so here we become 7 square minus 0 square is equals to 49 then 7 square 7 times 7 which is 49 then minus 0 square 0 is equals to 49 then of course 49 minus 0 is still 49 which is equals to 49 so here also the left hand side is equals to the right hand side then we can also conclude from here that 7 a equals to 7 b equals to 0 satisfy the given problem thank you for watching don't forget the steps subscribe for more exciting videos turn on the notification bell share this video give it a thumbs up put your comment in the comment section and uh, see you in the next class okay. Bye for now.